it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode four, freaking finally, <laughs> of Ruby Ice Kingdom, because it felt like forever. I mean, okay, because of the fact is we all got the three episodes all in one, and the fact that we had to wait three extra weeks, like, to me, that took so fucking long. I felt like a, a whole freaking <laughs> year <laughs> went by, or a month, because I'm like, damn. We ain't even at episode four yet, but finally. So I feel like today we're going to see Dark Place today, maybe. I'm not 100% sure, but other than that, let's go ahead and get started on episode four and three, two, one, go. I don't hear anything. Oh, there we go. Made me think like, oh. That's pretty. No, oh, look at her. Oh, we're finally, of course, yeah, because they didn't give us an opening with the three episodes all together. It kind of gives me the Persona 5B animation feels, yeah. It's not bad, it's good. Yeah, it's good. It's simple. And you know what? Honestly, I'm okay with that. With, with, especially with Volume 1, of course, they have to be simple with it because, oh! So where the hell is Blake and Yang? Okay. A train, will ya? Oh, God. <laughs>
it might take you where Weiss is, so. Well, not Weiss, Weiss, Dark Weiss, of course. It would be a fucking maze. Like, oh my god. I get it. Because, of course, Weiss is like that. So basically call if absolutely necessary. or waste them off. <laughs> oh, of course, her dad would be everywhere. Like, I don't think she would have anything on her brother because, of course, she gives two shits about her brother. Now, Winter, on the other hand, you would think...
well, of course, can't go that way. Because it would be too easy. The true path. Oh, well, that's bullshit. <laughs> Well, of course, that's a factory. Yeah, he's not. He's an ass. Blended, but damn. <laughs> oh. Oh. I don't trust him. Is that John inside there? Oh. <laughs> really? Uh-huh. So where's Pierre then? Because of course, yeah, she puts Pierre on a high pedestal, so. There's a damn bat.
Is the shadow supposed to be winter? Still a little shit though. <laughs> Shut the f uh, God, I cannot stand him. Well, damn. <laughs> what well, damn? So winter is supposed to be Well, I would rather be a buck than a bat. I'm just saying. Oh. 
And of course, because it is in her world, she's more OP. God, you only have one. Oh, she looks so beautiful. Damn. Damn, that's how we get What? <laughs> Well, you know, having my best girls, like, literally fight in this episode, I mean, you know, having the one best girl save the other best girl, like, yes, I love it, because they are, like, well, because, see, we would have to go into the shipping thing. Do I still ship them? I, I mean, it depends on how I feel. It is bringing back memories of how, like, I was like, oh, yeah, like, every single time when they were bigger, it's so fucking cute and such. I mean, you know, to have an episode that really goes more in depth on Weiss's feelings, especially when you're looking at the original series, is good. I have no problem on that. I love that because there were times, especially even when I officially dropped the show as a whole, that I kind of wish that they went more in detail on certain characters, but I get it because sometimes they don't have fun at them. They look so cute. Oh my God. Um, they don't have time because the last, the last time I remember like one of the trailers really going in and besides their initial red, black, yellow, and white trailers, I think it was either the volume four or volume five trailer. And it was one on Weiss. She was fighting, and then, you know, she she did hold her own, but then there was a point where she got scared. Um, and eventually she called out, oh, that's pretty, um, for Winter. And Winter came out and helped her. And she was like, I think Winter said something in the lines of, like, you have to be stronger because there might be one day where I might not help you. And because there's so much about Weiss and how who she is as a person, and because of her asshole dad and then everything else, because I, I'm, I'm like, I'm still kind of expecting this show to go a little more in depth on like her mom and her shitty brother. But even though I don't give a fuck about her shitty brother, because I, if it's obvious, I don't, I can't stand him. I, I couldn't stand him in the original series, and then literally seeing him in this makes my blood boil <laughs> and it. But once again, I would rather be a book than a fucking bat. I mean, but seriously, she looks gorgeous in this all white outfit. I mean, ooh. Um, cause it's so funny. Cause like, I think they, when they showed the prototype of the figure and I was like, okay, whenever they do show this and how it really is all nice and detailed, like your girl might have to cop it. But now seeing it in anime form, definitely. Yeah. I might have to cop that. But it, for an interesting episode, a filler type episode focusing on her, it, it was very interesting. I do hope that we get a little bit more. I'm hoping that Blake and Yang eventually come help because, yes, having Ruby do a, do it by herself. I completely understand that. But my baby needed backup. And, and you have the other two just there waiting. And it's like, hold up, hold up. When it was Jean, of course, Pira, and the rest of them came immediately. So why is it that it's just Ruby? I mean, because, of course, like, yes, Ruby and Weiss's, like, friendship, they're the ones who have bond the most out of the four. So initially, yes, it makes the most sense to make her go in first and then the other two to go in as, quote-unquote, backup, just in case Ruby, like, makes a fatal move, error, mistake. Totally get it. But, like, gosh, I was expecting all three of them. So I'm guessing we're probably going to get that more next week because I think what, I think around like last week was when I saw the trailer for both this episode and next week's episode. I don't really remember. Um, but yeah, I thought it was good. It went by quick. I, I think that's one of my little downfalls about it because one minute we were at the beginning, then we were at the eye catch supposedly, and now we're at the end of the episode. So 
I, I mean, yeah. <laughs> But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode four of Ruby Ice Queendom. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Sunday for episode five. Bye, guys.